I'm joined by NASA astronaut Peggy Whitson, two-time commander of the International Space Station. Peggy, thanks for talking with us. Yeah, it's great to be. Tell us about math. You're an astronaut. Do you need to use math when you're in space? Yeah, we do. We use math a lot. Uh, we're counting on the ground sometimes to tell us the specifics of, of a lot of you know activities that we're involved with. But we, we use math all the time. It's part of, of, the, of being there, I think. But it's not anything to be afraid of. I, I struggled with math in, in high school and in college, and it's, you know, it's still, it's all doable. You just have to keep practicing, and don't let failures uh, set you back or keep you from trying even harder and, you know, being successful. Because, at least for me, math was very intimidating, but you can overcome that. But even now, you know, now and then there's mistakes that happen. Did you ever make a mistake? Oh yeah, on orbit I was doing in this experiment and it was actually a really cool experiment where we were looking at a colloidal solution of iron and putting it in, in an electromagnetic field and that solution would become solid. Wow. It was really cool and it's, you know, potential future applications for earthquakes and suspension bridges and buildings, you know, to increase tensile strength mm -hmm. during an earthquake. But I had to put in the, uh, dial in the uh, electromagnetic, electromagnetic field strength and uh, instead of uh, 20 hertz, I put in two decimals zero because I didn't see the decimal very well, but I made the mistake. And what happened then, they saw that instead of a solid, it formed this wave pattern. So it was actually kind wow. of interesting that I did make a mistake and they, they discovered something that they hadn't seen. So you learned from that mistake. Exactly, exactly. And the scientists went back and we repeated all the investigations at uh, 2 hertz instead of the 20 hertz too. So it, it was a kind of one of those serendipitous uh, errors. So don't be afraid of mistakes either. <laughs> you can, you can uh, sometimes, you know, take advantage of them, but also always uh, remember it's how you handle the mistakes that will make all the difference. Awesome. Thanks for talking with us.